Okay, um, in this video, I will show you how to send a personalized mass email in Gmail to group of people. All you need is a Google account. So how to do it? You need the following. A Gmail address with the draft email you'll use for email blasting. So example, this is my, uh, this is the email, email draft. A Google Sheet. A Google Sheet that contains a, uh, a that contains the email address of your campaign targets with uh, personalized information like name. Okay, this is the names. And lastly, the YAM add-on within the Google Sheet. I'll explain it to you later. So, let's go to my draft. For example, this is our Gmail draft. I added a marker here. Okay. All right, I added a marker here which matches the name of the column in Google Sheet. So let's save and close it and go to Google Sheet to run the email blast. Okay, so to run it, I jump into the add-ons. But if you don't have it, you have to get it from the, uh, from the, from Google. I, I don't know where, where you're going to get it, but you have to click add-on. Click get add-ons. Sorry, it's add-ons. And then on the search box, type mail merge. Then hit enter. And then you will see yet another mail merge. So click on that. Okay, and then um, you have to click install. I already ins installed it on my, my account. That's why uninstall showing up here. So let's say, for example, you already installed it. So close that, um, close that box, and then click Add-ons again, and you will see yet another mail merge is already here on your Google Sheet Add-ons. So again, click yet another mail merge, start mail merge, and let's wait for a few seconds. So YAM stands for yet another mail merge, okay? And then just skip this too, click the continue button. Okay, so on the sender name, you can type the sender name. I mean, what, what, what would you like to be the sender name, okay? For example, my name, you can also change it to yours. And then the template, select your email template from the drop save in Gmail. So this is the template that I save from my Gmail account. If you have a lots of draft, you can start it in that way. You can easily find it here. Okay, so after that, um, we have three buttons here. We have send three emails. This is um, send three emails right away, delay delivery and receive a test email. Uh, we can even send a test email to myself to make sure we've got everything just right before sending the emails. Okay, so let's start sending email blasts. So I, one second, you can use sheets to, okay, that's fine. It's work perfectly. So it says here, all emails have been sent. So click OK. All right, so as you can see here on this side, it is a tracking report. We can even track uh, which emails are opened, click, and also bounce. Okay, so column three automatically showing up here. Okay, so it says here that in this email address already, I mean, the draft email that we sent is already been sent. Okay, also, on the other email address. So let's open, let's open this email address. This is actually my husband's account. So let's open it. Okay, as you can see, here's the email that we've sent. So open it and then go back to Google Sheet. Okay, so you will see here that in Gmail, in libidblitz22 at gmail.com, email address already open. Okay, so, that's it. So if you have any question, you can drop a message on Google. Go, I mean, Hangout. Thanks.